But again, sheer promotion. So, okay. so who wants to go first? Well, you know what? Why don't we start with we'll start you with because her. you have this film coming up. Yay! And apparently, you get to die again. I do. And you're excited about it. I, well, I'm excited about it because one, I've read the script and it's phenomenal. It's called The Sam's. Uh, the role that I'm actually will be playing Are you one was of the written for me. No, no, no. I, I play a, a teacher who her child has been killed uh, two so years prior. So it's a prior. comedy. <laughs> yeah, total okay. comedy. Okay. <laughs> and then I'm I'm pretty much going insane, and then I end up getting killed by the Sam's uh, spirits. I love it. Print. Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> It's uh, a friend of mine read the script because he was uh, auditioning with me, and I go read the script, okay. and he went, "Oh my God, it's brilliant! I want a part of it." I'm like, "Well, there's two two roles that you'd be up for, so come on, audition with me." Because we sent it off to Tampa. Did he get in? We'll see. Oh, you don't know yet. For him, but no. you know, you're you're they you're loved in. Me. They loved me. I'm like, well, yes, why wouldn't they? Care. Right? She set the other guy up. <laughs> That's right. He has no chance. No, he's perfect for two roles. <laughs> I'm actually, I've been behind and I've helped casting directors and, mm -hmm. I can, and I can actually walk into an audition and go, I'm not exactly what you're looking for, am I? And they're like, not really. And I go, I've got the perfect person for you. Do you want me to make a call? That's and they're very like, yes. nice of you. And they'll actually hire that person. They're like, damn. Has she ever done that for you? Mm -mm. Nice. No, because I, I don't go on the auditions that she'd be in. We don't look Why is that? We don't go we don't for the same not, roles? No. <laughs> We're not in the same if category. If I came across something uh, that would be perfect I, I for you, I know I would she would. No, I totally. I, know I would hook her up. No question. <laughs> nice. So, but if you're okay, so why are you so excited about dying again? Is dying fun? Uh, <coughs> it's hard. It's a challenge, mm -hmm. and I like it. Okay. What's What's and hard about dying? Not doing you, it. Well, you've never. I've never or? been. I've never died in real life. <laughs> no. 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 Wow. We'll, we'll edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot okay. Of I statement. can bomb, but no, I've never died in real life, and so you know, it's it's to me. You, you, there's different variations of dying, and mm -hmm. you I've know. been killed by a basketball. Yeah, it was hard. There you go. I understand. We must go to that now. I think. <laughs> when I were you killed by a basketball? It's a film out now. You can actually go to Blockbuster. It's called Sorority Sister Slaughter. <laughs> yeah. No. It's the real deal. I don't like horror films. I, if a, a scary commercial is on, I have to mute it. And if you try to keep the remote from me, I will get upset <laughs> because you know I don't want to hear anything. So anyway, it's called Sorority Sister Slaughter. Mm -hmm. I played, I'm one of the leads. And um, <laughs> because it's kind of a, the reason they were, they killed me with a basketball is because I did a film in 2000 with Spike Lee called Love and Basketball. Okay. So it did really well in theaters, and that's kind of what I'm, that's what I'm known for. Like, people know me from that film mm -hmm. and my character, so. so they tied it in. They tied it in. Why not? So basically, I'm on the ground, I'm running, of course I trip and fall. Don't give it away. Black people <laughs> do not trip and fall <laughs> in horror films. We don't fall, they the, fall. The white girls fall. The white girls fall, and they can't get up for some damn reason. That's but right. I fell and I was like, really? I can't get up? <laughs> okay. So he catches me and then he takes the ball and just slams it on my face like 15 oh. times. And it hits my face and smashes my face and busts the back of my head open. It was great. Fine. A and family now she's reoccurring, film. Now she's reoccurring uh, Law & Order. Yes. Let's talk about that. Yes. I, I, I filmed on Law & Order Los Angeles, mm -hmm. uh, the new one, right. um, about three weeks ago as Officer Venuti. And um, I usually do well with the cop roles. It's kind of my thing. I don't know why. <laughs> but uh, they, I got the call yesterday when I got here that they want to bring me back. And Nice. You know, so usually that it'll get rolling there. Mm -hmm. you know? And, yeah, so that's exciting. I'm working on my first short feature. I'm teetering between whether I want to make it a short or a feature. I've written the short, but the idea is people are like, you should make it a feature. So anyway, so I'm, I'm branching off, but my goal is to have a TV show or be working consistently. Now, yeah, yeah with the TV show, that's a pretty good grind, isn't it, though? I oh, mean, yeah. you're it's constantly co it's going. It's constant, and I don't mind that. Like, I want to wake up and be on set at 5 a.m. and work. <laughs> I know that sounds crazy. I worked on a movie where you were constantly work, work, work. The mm -hmm. only rest that I had uh, on my schedule was in hair and makeup. I lost a good 10, 15 pounds on that film, and I loved it. Yeah. It just from constant, running around so just much? Constantly, yeah. back and forth. A, A team going to B team, back to A team. But at least a movie, it ends. 
right? I mean, you you it rap and like you're done in te television show. Yeah, that could that could be a no, long. I, I, I'd I don't be more than more than happy. <laughs> on a TV show. I don't mind going three or four seasons. <laughs> no, yeah, and of course, Law and Order is one that's going to do that. I yeah. mean, the, it's 14 seasons of the original one or so mm -hmm. now coming out on DVD. And still and it's just coming out. It's still special a new special unit and this and that and yeah, Sesame I'm Street, Law and Order, whatever. Olivia Benson is my hero. Like, <laughs> really, when I used to go in for cop roles, I'd. I think of her and her mannerisms, and she's the bomb. And if I ever work, well, you with can't her. help but get the walk when you, because I've played a cop before, mm -hmm. and the minute you put on that belt and stuff, it's you can't, you can't help you but can't get that. You get that swag. <laughs> yeah, you do, swag, because yeah. you can't really move the same way. So the it's, costumes help establish yes, they character. They really of course do. They do. Okay, so uh, briefly though, the one that you were putting together, might you have that ready for say next Sundance? Um, it's a possibility. Hmm. I mean, if we decided to do, you know what? Yes, put that out there. It's a possibility. Like, I'm, I'm, there's no question that it will come here. And like, what's the name of that one again? Well, it's called Troy Speaks the Truth. Okay. And I, I technically can't really talk about it. I can tell you the name. Okay. But it's not. I can't talk about it yet. But it's called Troy Speaks the Truth. Okay. You let us know when we can talk about it. No, really. Yeah, I, I really want to talk. <laughs> yeah, about I wasn't it. giving you much either. No, I'll tell you what. When, when you, no, <laughs> really no, no. When you, if if it's ready next year, we'll yeah. be here next year, and we can follow up. And then yes. Yeah. And will you remember us? I will you? give you well, cards. We're you getting, yes, we, have we will cards. absolutely. No, no, no. I don't. I mean, will you remember? How can I in forget? In your mind. How can I forget? We won't let him forget. We'll see you on television, all the time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tough to forget. Yeah. All right. Okay. So here at Sundance, though. Yes. Um, just get in today? We got in Thursday. Well, oh, Thursday. Friday morning. At like 2.30. We uh, nice, got right? into the hotel at 3.30 in the morning. And have you had a chance to see anything yet? Or are you just kind of checking out Park City and shopping and whatnot? Yesterday, kinda, yeah, we kind of hung out at the Sundance Channel. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, we went to different lounges, saw yeah, people. Bing and, yeah. We ate a little bit. Okay. Um, but today's going to be the day to yeah. just, we're going, we're going hard today. Yeah, we are. We might not sleep tonight. Where are you going tonight? Where are we not going we not tonight? Going, well, we're going to go to the, the, kettle, the kettle One party, where okay. 50 Cent is. Kettle and uh, Case. Kettle, case kettle. Yeah. And then the Bing. Mm -hmm. Right, which Bing. Is, I don't know. Uh, then there might be Harry O's. Bing's the thing. Mm -hmm. Harry O's is Third Eye Blind this evening? Yes. I believe. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. So, you know, wherever we float into. Yeah. We'll go where the wind takes us. Well, are you, I, I'm always wondering what, you know, what celebrities, celebrities want to meet? Is there anyone that you, oh, hey, if you see him on the street, Oprah. you're going to try to say hello. Oprah. She's here, I'm pretty sure. She's here. Yep. I w I'm going to give Oprah a kiss on the cheek. Is that a black thing? <laughs> no, I just love no, her. No, but she's not going to say Oprah. What? Yeah. She's not going to. I like Oprah. You didn't mention her? Yeah. Uh, because I was trying to think of, but I, I was <laughs> just like, who would I really, really want to meet? I'd rather work with them. I'm well, I'm meeting way. him first. I mean, if you saw yeah. someone on the street, would you go, oh, okay, I'm going to walk up to, who would it be? Uh, that would have to be um, <laughs> mm -hmm. Jolie. Angelina. Angelina. <laughs> okay. Why yeah. you laugh? Why? Because I just like the way it's I, Jolie. See, it's not I, Angelina Jolie. It's I would Jolie. actually like to play opposite with, or with her, actually, in something that was Resident Evil, Mila Kolovich okay. meets Laura Croft. That's my mm. ideal role. And then mm. to work opposite of her would be really cool. Would you get killed again? No, I'd like to do all the killing. Oh. Yeah, I want to be the tough one. So and I am ambidextrous, so I can use those knives and those guns both ways. So you want to meet Oprah and you want to kill Angelina. <laughs> I didn't say kill, I said work right. with her. Okay, okay, okay. We, we would be adversaries in the movie. It's all good. Okay. How many times do they have two female leads who are dominant in the film? That's true. Who are going to take over the world? Thelma Louise, mm. but that was a while ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's not Resident Evil it. meets Laura Croft. That's either. true. I'm trying to think Weapon. of all the ones that she's in, and she is it. Yeah, that's more romantic comedy. Yeah. yeah, I'm thinking. Okay, okay. Yeah, she's <laughs> I get it. You're scary. I get it. It's fun. A little bit. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you but very much. Fun. Uh, no, I'm sure it's fun. I, I, uh, we've Diversity. done a little bit of. Uh, well, almost any independent filmmaker prob probably does horror first, mm -hmm. yeah. because. Horror makes a lot of money. Yes, yeah, they do. It does. It, it, yes, they do. People I just go a see lot of that horror. stuff. <laughs> um, people love it. And they know what's coming and they still go. 
See, the only thing I don't like is when they give it away in the middle of the movie. I'm like, if you get rid of this scene and this scene, your movie would be perfect. Mm -hmm. Get rid of the scene, the, the scene that um, tells the end. Tells the story. Or worse, <laughs> in the trailer. Oh well. Yeah. I started writing a horror and I got so scared that I stopped. <laughs> I'm not That's the good one. <laughs> That's what you should be making. You and you can put joking. her in it and she can yeah, put somebody. Not even joking. I'll help you finish I was terrible. <laughs> I, I was like, oh, this is awful. My God. Why don't you finish that? That sounds promising, yeah. wouldn't you say? No, you understand. It really scared me. Let the nightmares go. It's hard. Like, I really, I don't like, I'm, I figure it's enough evil in this world that I don't need to write anything like this. Because mm -hmm. your mind well, really- you're getting it out of your system. It's okay. Right. Okay. Well, you know what? Maybe I will. <sighs> <laughs> if you do, then you have to come back and, and talk, and talk to about somebody. it. Yeah. Okay.